what's up guys it's your boy and i'm uh, back here with an with a cool video today now this one's about um two old masks two old uh elusive concepts masks and um it means a lot to me and uh i'm gonna go ahead and give you guys a little uh backstory about it and um why it's so cool to me and uh let's get it Ladies and gentlemen, here we are with the um, Elusive Concepts Ratman. It's a pretty cool mask. It's pretty old. Um, if I had to guess, I'd say early 2000s sometime. Um, the sculpt is just cool, you know. Back in the day, they made masks. It's so crazy. I mean, they made these designs just like all over the place, you know. Little feet prints and stuff. Yeah. Um, but this mask um, is special to me because... Um, Back in the day, my dad used to run sort of a homemade haunted house at his own house. And he would build these, um, we called them dummies. And um, essentially, they're just like um, a wooden uh, statue. Or, uh, you know, like, um, he, it would sort of look like a like a guy was standing there, you know. And he would put um, old ratty clothes on them and uh, cover them in blood. And he would buy these cool old, old wicked masks and um, put them on there. And he would have these characters all over the yard. And then uh, come Halloween time, he would fire up fog machines and uh, strobe lights and play music and scare the hell out of everybody. Um, and everybody in my family really, really remembers this guy. Um, because he's just easily memorable, you know. I remember my dad built him and he had a, um, like a tan shirt on with some jeans and, um, and he added extra rats all over his body and, and, you know, a bunch of blood and, you know, made him look like he was really getting attacked. And, um, you know, it was just a thing, you know, every year, you know, you, you see Ratman every year out in the yard, you know, where's Ratman? Where's Ratman? Oh, there's Ratman. You know, he became this sort of uh, neighborhood iconic, you know, Ratman, you know. And um, when I recently got back into collecting, um, you know, knowing that there's all kinds of old masks out there, I, I was wondering if one of these would be out there. And, um, I just went on eBay and looked up Ratman. And, um, lo and behold, it was made by Elusive Concepts. So, um, I picked this one up for my dad as a gift. And, um, this one's pretty mint besides a few paint chips. Um, but it's pretty much mint. And, I mean, it's a really great paint job on it and stuff. And, um, and then earlier this year... I was window shopping on eBay because I'm an avid eBay window shopper and um, and I found another one. So I picked this one up for me. Oh, 1998. Wow. So yeah, but I think my dad had it in the early thousands. But um, this mask is as old as me. That's funny. But um, yeah, so this one I got for my dad and then I found another one for me. Um, and I don't think anybody out there would care too much about me hoarding these masks. Uh, but it definitely has sentimental value to me. And uh, you don't realize, you know, how much how much something has an impact on you until you see it again after all these years. It was crazy to see this guy again, you know. I mean, it bring back a bunch of memories. Um, I have a photo. I have one photo of um, my cousin. Um, the newspaper, um, my dad made the newspaper like every other year because his, his, um, decorations were so extravagant and, um, the news people came by and they, um, interviewed my cousin Paige 
and they took a photo of her in the yard and it just so happened that she was standing next to Ratman. And so that's the only photo I, I have right now of him. And I'm gonna go ahead and put that on the screen. Look at that. Ain't that cool, man. Um, you know, they just don't do Halloween like that anymore like they used to. But, um, yeah, I just wanted to show that off and um, kind of explain why this guy means so much to me. Um, it's a very cool mask. And although I am a younger guy, um, Halloween still was amazing when I was a child. And I had many, many great years um, celebrating the holiday. And it's just not like that anymore, you know. You just don't make them like that no more. But, um, yeah, that's about it for a rat man. Um, hope you guys enjoyed that little story time and my sleepy voice. <laughs> And um, until next time, guys, as always, peace, love, and rock and roll, baby.